welcome to another sports templates.net tutorial today we're going to work on the Grand Slam baseball uniform template uh, to create the San Francisco Giants uniform I've already made some research on Wikipedia and decided to do this uh, alt uniform for the Giants and already prepared a little Photoshop uh, library to help me go through the tutorial to get started I'm gonna work on the front view and we'll start with the cap so here we have the effects and we have the cap on its own uh, layer. From here we're gonna work on the cap peak so I'm gonna click on the peak here and change the color to the Giants orange and then we need to add the logo from here we're gonna pick the San Francisco logo to put on the front hat and we save Then we can change the middle parts, so can go with an orange as well. We can also work on the stitches. So here we have the cap stitches. Uh, prefer to go with the cream here, and also we can change the peak stitches. So we can go with the black. What's nice about this template is that you only have to work on one view. So now we've done this front cap, and we've already got the rest of the caps updated as you can see here they are automatically updated in here I forgot to update the uh, the plastic part so I can just go here and pick the plastic strap and let's give it an orange color so it updates also on all the versions now moving on to the uniform I'm gonna start with the jersey so going to the top here we have the effects on one layer and we have the design on a different layer so here we have the top we go to uh, the base the main shirt color and we pick orange and it's ready then here I have the body stripes uh, I can just turn them off these are totally edible so if I want to change colors or anything I can do whatever I want but for this one we're gonna turn it off we're gonna start updating uh, this template we have on the right arm the San Francisco logo so we can put it change color and see and you can see it automatically updates here so it does as well on all let's update the left arm see you can see it automatically updates now moving on to the chest we had the Giants here remove this and we're doing posy so we give it 28 and save also updates on all views for the undershirt we have the same black color but uh, here we have a black stripe going on top here so here we have two types of stripes in design options if we go we have sleeve big stripe and sleeve small stripe I'm gonna turn off the small one and turn on the big one and it's already black so we'll leave it at that now for the color here we have a black line going across here so we're gonna turn off the color main and we need to turn on the outer lining this one is straight close to it so we're gonna take a look uh, this one is a little bit further so we're gonna turn it off and turn on this one we can make it a little bit lighter if needed and do something like this we can even change the buttons colors so with the buttons we're keeping it orange we can even change the button threads so let's do a cream color and now going down to the pants 
we have this cream color going on for the pants so we're now pretty much done for the jersey so we close the top and go to pants for the pants uh, also pick in the cream color and removing the stripes uh, for the belt I'm going with cream again I'm gonna make it a little bit darker and we need to add a, a side stripe as we see here the same thing goes for the pants if you look across everything has been updated just for working on one view now we'll move on to the socks and shoes so for the socks we have black and orange so we're doing here we do the black and for the stripes I'm doing orange we can even change the shoe spikes to orange as well and the shoelaces all of the shoes can be changed to whatever color we want uh, but I'm gonna leave in black now everything is pretty much done we just need to update uh, the type on his back uh, so if you go to top back number we do 28 let's do black and let's make it a little bit smaller and we change the name we can even add uh, some styles to the number maybe a drop shadow with this gold color like this and maybe we add a stroke make it a little bit lighter now one more thing I forgot to add is the MLB logo and the Nike logo so let's get to it we need to add the logo the Nike logo on on the collar here so we go to the top grab the Nike logo and let's just position it and let's put the MLB logo on the cap and that's pretty much it just to show how easy you can edit this template uh, I've decided to do the this alt uniform so now that we have we have this pretty much ready we can just start changing colors uh, for example here we need to keep this black so we just go to the peak big black now go to top here we're gonna make the main body black as well now if we go to design options and we pick the color outer line and we make it orange as well as the big sleeve stripe here now we just need to update the chest text and logo for here if we turn on extras I've already laid out the center of the left chest so if I put the San Francisco Giants logo turn off the Giants logo and we make this one orange and we save we also need to update the right arm logo so from here we gotta pick the orange one and size it down and save what's left is just changing the back name and for the back number double click here and make the color orange and save I think the caps need to be a little bit darker we can just go here for the cap and go with a darker color as well as the peak zoom down a little bit to check out the uh, details the good thing about this template is that everything is separated so let's say you did this and you want to have more of a matte finish to this jersey you can go to effects and go to front and go to highlights for example you can turn it off and you get this more matte look you can also turn off specific lights so let's say we don't want this backlight we can just turn off this layer and we don't have it anymore the same goes for the rest of so I'm turning them one by one I can get any specific look that I want until I reach 
the final flat look and we can just like if you turn it on here we have the shadows highlights specular more shadows then the lighting pass and we have this one for the waist shadow uh, lighting reflections reflections and this rim lights and that's pretty much it thanks for checking our website and keep an eye on sportstemplates.net for more sports design templates freebies and mockups coming every other week